Leader Communication Skills One of the most powerful skills we can use as a group leader is active listening. Active listening has three key skills. Paraphrasing, clarifying, and reflection of feelings. Employing active listening effectively can help build a group very quickly as well as improve one-on-one -on -one relationships. Active listening. Active listening involves understanding and not simply hearing a speaker's words. Using skills to figure out the speaker's intention of what they're saying and understanding what their goal of communicating is rather than just hearing the words they're saying is the key aspect of active listening. The first skill of active listening is paraphrasing, restating the content of a message in another way. This does not mean restating exactly what a speaker has said. It's repackaging the message to make sure you've understood the words coming out of the speaker's mouth. The second skill is clarifying. Checking for understanding with a message by asking to hear it again or for more information or details. After a speaker finishes a story, you can ask a clarifying question like, well, can you tell me a little bit more about this part of the story? Or remind me, who again was involved in that part of the story? The third skill is reflection of feelings, potentially the most powerful skill an active listener can use once they've paraphrased and asked any clarifying questions is reflecting an emotion or a feeling that may have come up for the listener when the speaker was engaged in their activities. It sounds like you're feeling frustrated or annoyed when this happened. By sharing the emotional impact on you as a listener with a speaker can be a very powerful way to build closeness and make a group function more smoothly.